Do you hear that, guys? Yeah, you're right. It's a War Age. Welcome back to, to Tokyo Ghoul War Age, and we're here to just, just fucking do whatever, man. It's 8.37 a.m. This, this world is interesting, and I unlock Sukiyama via logging in a bunch. So I'm gonna try and use him, because I actually haven't seen... So I upgraded him a bunch, but I haven't actually played as him yet. So I'm actually really interested in seeing how he does his stuff. Um, I am lacking a few upgrade materials, so he's not quite at the same tier as Naki, uh, but he should be pretty solid. And what we want to do is we want to get 200 gems in this episode so that we're able to do a 10 pull at the end if possible. So I'm going to try to do my dailies while we're at this. So first of all, I need to open a chest. This one gave me a wee bit of coffee. Not that important, but that's part of the dailies, so... I'll take it. What else was there? So there's Hinami's thing. Oh right, I have to do her quest. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm going to unequip everyone. Everyone can can go away. Then we'll go through the list according to power so we have the best possible team going into this. Alright. I need to play a Sukiyama. So I probably should have selected him as my first person, but I'll just swap to him. It's all okay. I have hiccups, by the way, for some reason. Every time I start recording, I should probably be doing like vocal warm ups before I start this. So I think that's the ideal, but it's okay. I should be. All right. His, his fucking Kagune looks terrifying, to be honest. Okay, so he has a bunch of stabs. It looks like the thing he did against Noro. He has an extent extending thing, and his ultimate is a huge jab downwards. Let's just, you know what? Let's just watch him play. I'm curious. The first is several stabs. It reminds you of the 1, 2, 3, 9, and 10. And then he throws them away. That fucking weird thing. Also, this is a tower defense, and I totally already am dead, so... Whoops. Okay, that looks really cool, though. Sukiyama, that was a cool idol animation. Oh, Ryoko's dead. We just died on the first wave. Second wave. But that's not great. I should probably do better. But in the end, that's just for the daily anyway. It's all okay. Uh, we'll go ahead and claim that for now. And I do believe that we need to do a couple more. I just don't remember the exact amount, but we'll go ahead and do this. Sure. Wait, does that take 24? I didn't take 24 gems, did it? Totally did. Okay, well, I'm never gonna do that again. Thanks for your patronage. Didn't even equip Sukiyama. Good job, me. I, I just kinda wanna do this anyway, cause despite me already getting the daily done, this thing does offer really good rewards, so I will take that. Plus, Naki is fucking great on levels like this, so it's kinda fun to use him. So, you know what? This was a good thing. This is, this is, this was a positive influence on our current time in this world. And you know what? That real. I will I will take that to the bank and we will cash it in for potentially a little bit of store credit so we can buy some some good old you know those little Rolo chocolate things that kids want really hard that adults when they think of it they start to feel really sick. Like little Rolo caramel chocolate milk things that they sell inside like shoppers and like drugstores. Yeah, those. Th that's, that's, that's the equivalent of what we, we are currently doing in this world. And you know what? That's how it should be. In the end, we're all just pieces of chocolate milk drifting through the expanse that is space and very, very slowly beating the bosses that apparently have like actual bird wings. What the fuck? This man, it just he's just fucking Archangel from the X-Men, and I don't know why. Like, not this guy with the shield. This guy looks like a fucking MOBA character, but the other guy, he just had bird wings. And I don't understand, but I'll take it. Honestly, this game has such unique designs. It's so weird. Every part of it is something new and fresh. You, I have never seen these white suit guys adapted 
I guess except for like that one scene that said Route A, but let's be honest, it doesn't actually count because no one fucking watched Route A because it was bad. But, God, it's fucking great. It's red. Oh, that's a new game mode. Oh no. What are you, what are you giving me? You, ga you gave me Kaneki lying. That seems like a pretty bad thing to give me. Oh, I unlocked a new trial thing. I'm gonna actually swap, but oh no, my party's fine because I have Sukiyama already. Cool. Let's try it. God, this is gonna be. This is a new game mode as well, so knowing my luck, this is gonna be just like the the hardest thing in the world, and I'm gonna die in the first ten seconds. Hey, how you doing? Oh, it's a cash money one where I have to just beat your ass in. Cool. Hell yeah. Let's get some money. Oh, you run away. Oh shit. I'm gonna I'm gonna just deal with you then. I could probably I could probably kill this first level pretty easily. Uh, I've about a minute left, so it's 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 a reasonable amount of time to be honest. I don't know how long has passed, and it actually might have been half a minute, so we actually might be be able to not do this. I'm unsure. Fingers crossed, at least. I need to use this uh this thing. Oh, it has meteorite fall, apparently. That's very strange, but I'll take it. Apparently, that's half de halfway down the health. We have a chance. Um, if it was 1:30, that was the total time for this. That means we're about halfway at halfway, so we have a we have a decent amount of luck when it comes to the ability to actually beat this. But we will see here whether I can do enough damage and actually win. I like the voice clips for Sukiyama, by the way. He doesn't really seem like he's intent on killing, but he's just kind of having some fun. You know what? That's how gacha games should be. No one should be serious. They should just have a good time. No one should be like, I'm going to quit this game if I don't get the, the SSR Naruto. Because that's... It's, you're not going to get him. You're just going to gonna lose that battle, if we're being honest. I got a couple of crystals, though. No idea what that does, but it, I, I will take JO crystals if you can give them to me. Thank you. What is, is oh it's oh it's an upgrade tree thing isn't it? I'm just oh, you you use the crystals to get new masks? That's fucking awesome! What? Hell yeah, dude! That's rad. Okay, wow, that is actually really cool. God damn it! Every every time I get something new, it feels cool. It's so weird. I'm not used to it at all. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and... Oh, this is the PvP game mode that I can't actually do. Damn it! Because it, there's some kind of timer on it or something. I just can't actually activate it, unfortunately. I have to do three PvP battles. Okay. Um. Sure. I'm gonna swap up my team a little bit as well. Just because y'all know we already love that Tsukiyama life up in here, so... Let's do it. We should be able to win, honestly. Uh, Amon with his Kura. Actually, it's not Kura. It's the, the the street sign thing. Isn't too bad to take it down. Plus, like... Oh, yeah. I got off screen. I forgot to mention this. I got the gourmet guy that we're fighting currently. The big, the big fat guy that's, like, throwing his stuff and jumping. Yeah, no. I, I got him. Uh, don't like him at all. I could show him off if you want in the next episode or something, but like does anyone actually care about him? Let's be honest here. He's just kind of there and existing. Also, this, this second wave is just the default party. We shouldn't have too many issues, to be honest. Plus, my Meteor Fall came in. We're taking one damage per hit. Yeah, no, we should be fine. Sugiyama, I would appreciate it if you were to use your third. Hell yeah! Destroy the entire enemy team. Good job, my dude. I appreciate that. So that's one out of three. Three. That I have to do today. Uh, I'll try to fight the Sinam. No, I can't do that. I have to wait a couple of minutes. Damn it. Well, I guess we're going to take a couple of minutes to actually get that ready. Also, I appear to have lost there. Didn't know that, and that's kind of sad. But it's all okay. Um... Hmm. Three hard mode levels? I can probably just sweep that, right? Like, you guys you guys don't give a shit if I just sweep this three times to get 
like the quest done, right? There we go. Yeah, no, the, the game the game was like, oh yeah, feel free, dude. We don't care. So, good. Uh, three three. Not at that yet. So I'll just go ahead and play this myself. Let's do the hardest guy. The most difficult battle possible. Let's see what they can do for me. Actually, I haven't been playing this game mode at all. I probably should be, to be honest. Um, the rewards are pretty solid. I just... After I do the daily, I forget to pull it back up. So I just never actually do it. It's the PvP where you actually like play as the characters. A weird one. Where you actually have to put in strategy. I mean... You're supposed to put in strategy. And you're supposed to be doing like actual combo stuff. But I just... I just use the attacks. And they work. Because I never actually play beyond the first thing here. It's kind of sad, to be honest, but it's okay. Because I'm going to go ahead and get my daily done. And I will be happy. Thank you for that. That's 20 more gems, with a goal of 30 at the end. We want 200, though. So maybe it actually might be ba better if we just do proper quests here. Maybe just try start trying to go through chapter 10 and see if we can get far enough to get 200 gems off of it or something. Or maybe we can go back and try and catch up some stars for levels that we actually weren't able to get done properly before. Just to be able to get... Oh! This this is one of those, uh... This is a, this is a owl battle sequence. So basically, you have two teams. It's MOBA-esque. And you're meant to beat the enemies and protect your owl while beating the enemy owl. And basically, owl is your tower. Uh, at the end of your your MOBA stage, so it's your fire gi or not fire giant, it's your titan, it's your uh, phoenix, it's 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 any of that. So it's actually kind of fun to play, to be honest. Uh, the actual content of it is pretty repetitive, but that's just kind of how MOBAGE go. Honestly, in games like this, everything becomes repetitive at some point. So as long as you enjoy it the first time, it's fine. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. Thank you for that. I like to clear this wave before the entire enemy team comes in and fucks my asshole. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, you know, no, I, I understand what you're trying to do. Um, I'm dead. Super dead. Uh, not, not alive anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and pop my King K thing and completely miss and feel sad about myself and my entire existence. I like my, my like minion guys, by the way. So the enemy team has the CCG. And my minions are like little wadly Algiri guys. It's really cute. Look at them. The guys in the back are just like. <laughs> I love it. I'm happy. All right, Amon. Die, please, God. See, he, he's not gonna go and heal properly because I'm totally actually on top of his owl. And if he doesn't, if he doesn't attack me, I win. So. It's okay. And can I get the kill here? Uh, nope, nope, I'm being spun. There we go, cool. No well, Wadley guys were able to, to get that shit done. Three stars actually ain't bad too. So that gives us even more. Potentially, does that give me the reward for the this chapter? Yeah, I got the first reward, cool. Uh, Hinami and 10 gems, not, not great, honestly. Not what I expected, but. I need to clear up some gems. I don't know, like, what... Back in, like, chapter 4 is when I got not 3 stars. Wow. Yeah, no, I have plenty of stars to get here to actually get the end game benefits. Let's go ahead and try and play Sukiyama here to see if we can get our gems off properly. Oh! This is the, this is the gourmet level! Oh, shit! This is, like, the, the church. We're fighting the Tsukiyama with our Tsukiyama. That is the, the funny thing. Also, we have Nishiki on our team. Honestly, this arc, I forget about this one the most, but it's honestly fantastic. It's one of those ones that's mostly just a setup arc for, for like, characterization and stuff, but, like, god damn is it fantastic. Plus, like, there's so many shocking moments with, like, the, the reveal of Tsukiyama's eyes. Um, the bite on the shoulder with Toka and stuff like that. It was just, it's so good. It's, yeah. I forgot about the early arcs of Tokyo Ghoul quite a bit. 
Honestly, before white hair happens, most people just kind of ignore. It's kind of sad, to be honest, because there was a lot of really good content back then as well for Tokyo Ghoul, but it's all right. We're enjoying our current time. So we got 20 more gems. So we, we would need to get another 180 or so. So we have a bit to go, but we're going to try and clear up the stars that we can get along the way just so we can get more benefits, you know? I should probably be doing the chapter 10 stuff because it actually gives me more gems in a short amount of time. And it's already been like 15 minutes, but you know what? We're just gonna have a long episode that goes until we end up getting a scout. I don't know if I'm meant to go up there. Probably not, honestly. That seems very not go up here E with the, the fire and the dead end, you know? Just, just maybe we don't have to go upwards. Also, I was just attacking the air while I put my other hand off the keyboard, so. Whoops. Bop, bop. God, Naki is so cool, though! Like, as a unit, he just... He does so well. So I think that your... Uh, your third, or your fourth, your your nuke, is based on your team synergy, actually. Because once I add Tsukiyama to the team and no longer had the Apple Girl, I started having this Meteor Fall uh, thing. So I think... It really makes sense to me, at least. That would be the case. Obviously, I don't know about this game at all, and all I know about it is the videos that I've watched from B about it, so... That's jack shit, in case you didn't realize. So, whoops. It's okay, though. It's, it's fun. In the end, you don't need to understand the game to have fun. Hell, I played Dark Souls 3 in, in Japanese when I went through that, so that was a unique experience. Um, let's see, 20 gems and one piece of Hinami versus just going to where I currently am and trying to get 15 and then whenever I get along the way. Actually, that's not really, those aren't really gems, honestly. Maybe these ones are better. Yeah, no, let, let's, let's try and clear these ones out. Um, I could probably just auto through them. Honestly, it shouldn't be that big of a deal, but I like playing the video game sometimes. Just how it works. Alrighty. Like, I'm pretty sure in BBS, if I could auto every quest, I still wouldn't. Just because the co-op quests are so fun to play with, like, good characters and, like... I don't know, man. It just, it feels like auto is a cop-out for me. And I, I like playing actual games myself. Also, my nose is fucking itchy. I'm not a huge fan of it. Oh, this is the layout where, like... Yeah, this is... This layout seems to happen really often, because I remember this fucking taxi in so many of these quests. It's not even, like, the actual level or layout that stands out to me. It's just the taxi. Oh, it's the Chimera King or, uh, Kagune guy. I'm glad I was able to take your life. I'm sure you had a good time. That man's Kagune is fucking creepy. He has, like... That's actual spider legs with, like, weird joints. Not a fan of that. Like spiders, don't like spider legs. And I hope that I can kill him right now. Good. Awesome. Good job, Tsukiyama. I'm gonna imagine that Tsukiyama's a huge DPS character that just kind of destroys everything. It would only make sense, at least. Alrighty. Um, one more and then I should be able to get the 20 gem reward, which is nice. Plus 20 more gems. I need so many more, dude. So many more. Fuck. Alright, um, oh, it's one of these fucking pick up body things. These quests, hmm. Not a huge fan. But I have to focus on just picking them up because that's the... That's the third objective. You're meant to pick up all eight bodies before you actually kill all of the enemies. So I'm, I'm trying to like, just focus that down and not actually fight the enemies. And hopefully we're we're like low enough in power where they won't spawn before we're able to pick up anymore. Fingers crossed. We need to get three more. <sighs> Please? One more? Come on. Oh, no, I got hit. Oh. 
they beat it. Before I was able to get all eight bodies. Let me try that again, and I'll jump to win that. Yeah. Nice job, guys. Even though it's that was literally all me. You know, you, you got you guys are part of the experience as well. Hell yeah, it's a fucking video. We're all here. We're all existing in this dimension that we like to call fucking Earth. So, in the end, is an experience that we all can enjoy when we complete a quest that was oh so difficult and have a great time. I'm gonna go ahead and do this level real quick and probably lose to it because my teams are awful most of the time. Uh, I don't even fucking, can I? I can auto fill. That is so much easier. Okay, we're gonna try to do this quest and see if we can get some rewards off of it. Then we can get the daily done and maybe get some more gems. I, it's, it's so hard to get enough gems every day. Maybe I don't need to do a 10 pull. Maybe I can just do singles and then just get the character. Because honestly, a 10 pull doesn't actually guarantee the character. It's it's every 10 you do get one, but I also have the, the free dailies I've been doing every day anyway. So I could probably just go straight for the character and just beeline for it, you know? And in the end, that could be the tipping stone that lets me be able to actually get more good characters. Maybe I'll be able to get an SS Ayato or something. Have a full team of four stars that can just crush entire teams by themselves, but all together can solo the world. We'll, we'll, we'll see, definitely. But this seems to be a lot of change that are po that's popping out of these enemies. I'll take it, because honestly I need to use that to level up Tsukiyama anyway. I actually need to change, or money, quite a bit. Hell yeah. So I, I actually was using um, my gold for draws a lot recently. Just cause like, you get so many good items off of it. You get the level up coffees, you get uh, several different iterations of like, small shards here and there. But if you get enough small shards, you're able to level up a character even further. Uh, like for example, um, plenty of my characters are now actually viable due to me getting more shards of them. Uh, Hinami was good after I got shards of her. Uh, the gourmet guy was kind of alright, I guess. I guess. Y you know how it goes. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and do our five daily pulls here with the gold, just to get it out of the way. Um, that should be another daily completed. Awesome. Uh, and you know what? We're gonna do it. Uh, I need to do four pulls. So we're gonna go ahead and do these one at a time and see if we can get anything good. First, first one, not great. Second, once again, not the greatest in the world, but we'll accept it. We need to do three more. That's one. That's two. Oh no, I just purchased two of these things. Well, I guess I can do both in a row. Okay, this is gonna be the guaranteed character. I have no idea who the fuck you are. But apparently you like Kaneki. Oh! You're the glasses guy's partner! You're the guy that, like, to Toka killed the partner of. That, oh, I'm so sorry that, oh. Kind of low-key feel bad now. It's whatever. Y you know. Shit happens. I actually want to get the final daily done, so I don't even know what I can do at this point. Oh, I can do the Narinas. Yeah, I can do that, but... So for now, I'm going to go ahead and go to Tsukiyama. Do this. Max him out fully. Uh, you know what? The autofill button with coffees has been very good to me recently, so... I think I'm gonna go ahead and level this man up as well. Oh wow, yeah, no, this is gonna suck, because now I have no coffees left for anyone else. Shit. Whoops. There's also only a three star. Probably shouldn't have done that, to be honest. It's okay, I'll just, I'll show them off in the next episode. That's usually how this shit goes anyway, so. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll, we'll be fine. What bonds do you have? You have the gourmet guy in Kaneki, you have a bin, you have Yomo and Toka. 
It's all right. I'm gonna go ahead and hmm. I'm gonna rank up all of his stuff. We're already at tier two apparently. Cool. And that's all right for now. Need a Kagune thing. Don't have that. If I had more money, I could actually do this. Upgrade him further. He's probably gonna pass Naki for highest power soon, to be honest. Just kind of how it seems like it's gonna go, but. Oh! I have no idea what that is, but thank you for that. Actually, I appreciate that. I'm gonna go ahead and open all of those, actually. Uh, purple materials, that's alright. I don't really use those yet, but I do appreciate that. Uh, not much there. It seems like I can't really do much with the rest of these. Yeah, no. Uh, that's That's been a, a good time. So, characters I need to show off in the next episode. So, if all goes well, I'll use gold draws to get the last six pieces I need for Ammon with his street sign. So, I'll be able to do a showcase of him along with our good old pal here in... Uh, don't remember your name. It is completely lost to me right now. She killed an investigator. I just don't know where it was. It's just not appearing on here at all. Oh, they kiss. Cool. But that's not what I care about. Whatever. It's all good. I, he He's someone. He is he is someone that exists. Also, I want to get Hachikawa, uh, the like weird mouth guy. Got 30 pieces of him out of nowhere for some reason, but unfortunately, the rest of him seems to be hard to grind out, so... We'll see. It appears to be from this. Oh, I got 30 pieces of him because I got, like, a decent rank on this. Oh, shit, dude. Okay, so what you're saying is I should be running this far more often to get more pieces of an S, of an S character. Cool. Good to know. Either way, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. It's been, it's been a good time. Bye.